I gotta add this to my Tinder profile. <laughs> Favorite uh, teacher. What do you want me to do? My dad bought me a car. I'll okay. Favorite I, teacher. Favorite teacher? I, I had this I had this teacher in, in college who I absolutely hated. The art student. But he's my favorite because he just pushed me and pushed me and pushed me. Okay. Can't remember his name. <laughs> Every right character in this movie, with the exception of Aldo, is pretending to be people they're not, or uh, playing a different role as far, you know, uh, with a Shoshana or anybody. But actually, Aldo is incapable of being anybody other than Aldo. <laughs> he, really he, he, he tries his best. <laughs> he's not throwing it away. He thinks he's doing Favorite it. Favorite gift to give? Favorite gift to give? Love. <laughs> Love that, Brad. Favorite gift you ever got? Same thing? Yeah. Okay. That's a gift. Uh... Oh, Jesus. Okay, this is really good. This is really good. Everybody has one of these. He's Favorite doing a good job. job. <laughs> uh, um, I just saw this. This uh, documentary that Morgan Freeman actually actually produced. Prom Night, Mississippi. Yes, yes, That's a great. Yeah, movie. it's really good. But you remember there was one father. His name was Glenn. Glenn. My name's Glenn, and you either like me or you don't. I hope you like me, but if you don't, well, I'm Glenn. <laughs> and, that's, and that's kind of the, you know, that's, that's kind of that Southern. Uh, the most enjoyable was probably, oh yeah, this one was pretty enjoyable. This was a fun one, with the exception of having to work with Mr. Pitt, who, uh, well, I mean, I never saw him not drunk, but other than that, it was probably doing this film, you know, uh, Catherine's a great girl, and he, he would love Catherine, and Julia's fantastic, and... Matt seems like a nice, nice enough guy. We didn't really talk, <laughs> um, but I would imagine this film, in general, for me, this film, except for uh, the first one. Except for because right now he's going, say it, say it, Brad, <laughs> say my name. I've told all the students for the past twelve years. You know, you know, you know, every yeah. now and then you get that 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 kind of dead poet society thing. That that guy who just goes completely against the norm and yeah. how a class is supposed to be run and how it's supposed to be taught in the book. And yeah. Tosses a book. And, and this was that guy. This was that guy. Whose name you can't yeah. remember. Okay. And my third grade teacher was nice looking. That's great. Okay. Uh, when you do go out, do you go out incognito? Like, how do you disguise yourself? I'm very covert. How? Yeah. I'm just, I, I'm kind of like the shark. I just keep moving. Hey, Bradford? Yes, Steve Arino. Do you think beauty is really only skin deep? I don't know. I've never taken my skin off. Landa Coca, who says, for you, Brad, I'd like to, uh, I'd like to know what it was like to work with George. Is he easy to work with? No, he's very difficult, Yolanda. He's a very difficult, difficult actor. Um, I want to be positive. I want to find some good find to some say. Good. And, and good. Uh, he is a professional. He's very dedicated to his craft. But thank you. It, 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 it's tedious on the rest of us. It's, it's difficult because um, there's, there's tantrums. There's uh, things are thrown, well, but there are good um, reasons for those tantrums. Yeah, southern... Do you remember what this role was? Holy, <laughs> is that me? Apparently. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's me. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. That looks like it was a long time ago. Wow. My hair looks as bad then as it does now. <laughs> no, true. That's amazing. Um, um, was one of them there was a good reason for it. Um, we, and, and we deal. Okay. We deal it's with fair. it. It's fair. It's fair. It's, he's well, right. I'm just glad the movie's over. Thank Me too. And the one with the goat and the and the Vaseline was not fully true. There was some other th that wasn't completely. It started with a kernel of truth. Yeah, as they usually got the line completely out of proportion. See, they told me not to ask that, so I'm uh, glad yeah, you brought I mean, that up. I, I didn't want to. We want to dress it. And yeah, we wanted that right here. It wasn't a goat. It's a small sheep. <laughs>